You arrived when you come to the circuit, you're all set, and everyone Brock has been talking about, this would be your circuit, and then what happened? <clears throat> yeah, unfortunately, um, after Japan, I came back and um, maybe, you know, I had brains hatch, <clears throat> hatch quite early, and then um, straight to Japan, and it was quite hot out there, and and um, the arm on the, on the flight on the way back swelled right up, and um, I thought it'd go down, you know, after two days, um, I was here in England and um, I tried to keep it elevated as much as possible and um, unfortunately it didn't go down. So I hopped on the bike Friday morning and um, I went out and to be honest the suit was that tight around my arm, I couldn't really move on the bike how I wanted to and um, it was my first time at this circuit but um, in general I liked the circuit, the layout was fast. A uh, bit of an eye opener for the first couple of laps, you know, it's quite bumpy around here but um, I felt that this could have been a, a round for me where I could have been strong. You know, Brands Hatch, uh, I had quite a good race meeting there and um, was going in the right direction. So, yeah, just a bit disappointed. I couldn't uh, could not ride here, but um, it's important for me now to, to get fit and uh, be 100% and come back and, you know, ride how I, how I should be riding when I'm, when I'm 100%. Even uh, Brands Hatch was a little bit uh, fresh after the operation, but... I felt good on the bike, I had no arm pump and um, I haven't had the, the arm pump since the surgery. So I think that once I get fit again and uh, come back I can be 100% and um, a lot of the circuits towards the end of the year are, are tracks that I know and big fast tracks that I like. So um, I look forward to, to them rounds.